We will. One, two, three. We will. One, two, three. We will. One, two, three. We will. Let's go. You guys came up with how we were going to play. We will defend. We will rebound. We will play together. We will be on time. Okay, so what we're going to do right now is we're going to take a pen and we're going to sign our name on the red here. Okay, and you might not be able to see it, but we know that we've signed a contract to how we're going to act this whole year. And I know we've already said it, but the season starts tonight. We're signing a contract with each other that we're going to get it done. All right, we're all signed up? Yeah! Yeah! Oh, stop! One, two, three. We will! We will rebound! We will defend! We will! For me, guys, this is the start of something that's going to be like the most fun four months of your life. I really feel special about this team. I feel like we're going to have a special year, but it starts tonight. Defend and rebound, and nothing changes. Play it like we practice. Play together. Trust your teammates. Let's go have some fun. One, two, three. We will. Well, you're going to like this team that Mark Turgeon has. A mixture of veterans and newcomers on this team. A team that Mark Turgeon certainly loves from the get-go. Male of Treble will start at the point guard spot tonight for Maryland. But Number one player in the state of Maryland. A lot's been made of Mello. Here comes this guy, local kid, that's a great kid, that's a heck of a player and very humble. He has a chance to be special, and he's always dreamed about being in Maryland. You've been waiting for this your whole life, right? I remember that first practice. I always dreamed about being a player at Kansas, and so I just said, you've been dreaming about this your whole life, and he has. And he sees himself having a great career. He's dreamed about that, too. <laughs> When he was recruiting me, I had told him that uh, I grew up watching Maryland, and um, I like Juan Dixon, C. Blake, and that whole team. And uh, Maryland's my home hometown. I always wanted to play for the name of the jersey. He is what I thought I was getting. He's one of our best team defenders already, and for a new guy to be one of your best team defenders, that's a credit to him and a credit to his coaching past. Coach Turgeon said that. Uh, First couple of practices is going to be based on defense, and I'm not really a defensive player, but uh, since we yeah, have been playing a lot of defense, I've adapted it, and uh, I like it now. I think that Melo's a tremendous, he's, he's so talented, man. I've never seen somebody that good as a freshman. Yeah, the newcomers have stepped up. They're, they're getting a lot of playing time, so they have to, but those young guys are coming pretty quickly. People that understand the game of basketball and have a good feel for it are going to love Jared because he's one of the smartest players that I've coached on the offensive end. He's just got a tremendous feel. We all knew he could shoot it, and he's going to be a great knockdown shooter, but his feel for the game is, has been a pleasant surprise. Michael Tchaikovsky, the 7-1 freshman from Slovakia, also in the Mark Turgeon lineup. I like saying Checo. I'll never coach another Checo, so I gotta say it as much as I can while I have the chance. But he is just a special human being. Unbelievably humble, a little bit unsure of himself, so we try to build confidence in him. He doesn't quite understand, but he shows flashes of like how great he can be. Team and coaches, like, like everybody tried to help me. Like I can't say like one person, like I think like Maryland basketball helped me so much. Guys that were around where Alex was here, not saying he's Alex, but we see a lot of the same traits and similarities. And so we're able to push him in a positive way to help him be successful. Dion's been a, a great surprise for me too because he probably had the furthest to come of the new guys. He had a lot of work to do on and off the floor. He's worked extremely hard. Just his dedication to wanting to be a great player and a great student and a great person has been just, it's been a joy to see. You know, Deion's really talented. He can shoot it, you know, he can take it off the dribble, man. He can finish, you know, he's, he's a special player. He has a great feel. He's one of our better passers on our team. I think Maryland fans will find out real quickly his vision on the court is, is really special. I think he liked that we all play the right way. We don't try to do nothing that we can't do. We just play our roles and we play hard. The Terrapins opening up tonight with a win over Wagner, 82 to 48. 
before 10,015 fans here at Xfinity Center. I thought everybody played pretty well. Jared got better defensively as the game went on. Dion defended well. And I thought Checo got better. I wanted Checo better. The young guys were good. The four of us, we all bring something to the table that definitely helps and it's a plus for the team. It helps going through with Jared, Checo, and Melo because knowing that they're young guys too and I'm, I'm not the only one in it. They really motivate me every day. But I feel like no matter how many players Coach Church brought in, it would have been the right number because he knows what we needed. So. Good job, guys. Good job, guys. Great defense. Up to 48, fellas. That was a good game. We got to go to the next game. Family on three. One, two, three. Family.